so I'm really excited because last night I managed to finish one of the sleeves on this drop stitch, stitch on this drop stitch top that I've been working on I don't know how well you can see this room is a bit but it is a drop stitch it also has a turtleneck of sorts so now I want to tackle the other side the other side but I'm really happy about this about the sleeve it looks really good on the length is amazing it comes to about there and then because of how big the hole is I can put my thumb through and I like that This is where the ball of yarn is at this point. So I'm just gonna get started. I just have to slip stitch the sides together and we're done. So I've just put my finger through one of the holes. The first one I made, because of some mistakes, some miscalculations, the turtleneck is huge. And then two ended up being asymmetrical on the bottom, which isn't the worst thing. It's not what I wanted though. That's why I didn't end up adding sleeves to it, because I was like, I didn't like the main body. So I just said, let me start over. I'm going to bed now. It's about 11.30 p.m. I should be sleeping. So I'm gonna go sleep. <laughs> so I'm trying to challenge myself design wise so what i'm doing is giving myself a prompt and i'm gonna try and develop a mini collection based on said prompt so what is this prompt you ask can you guess so alice in wonderland that's what we're doing this has definitely been done a lot the book has been around for Quite some time. The story has been told and retold. It has been reimagined in terms of animation, fashion editorials. Tons of people have done collections based on this. So 
So I'm just gonna see what I can come up with. I'm using Zoe Hong's design process. Keep her eyes open. Keep them peeled. This is the cover of this book, but like it was already falling apart when I bought it. So I just, um, should I have folded this? I don't know. But like, look at that. It's like, if I could do a photo shoot like this, and also. These are probably some of my favorite images. Um, multiple renditions of this have been made, but like these are probably one of my favorites. Her falling down the rabbit hole, and then her extended neck. Another one, another image that I love. Not this one in particular. Not not that into this one, but the images of her being larger than her space. Let me see if it's here. She's inside the rabbit's house. Ah, this one. Oh, here's one. This is not the rabbit's house, but her being too big for the space. Also, maybe something in water. I don't know how I would do any of these. I don't have a pool. Look at that. Wouldn't that be such a fun image? Oh, also a tea party scene would be fun. Oh my gosh, there's so many things even that would be so much fun Tea also there's an image that i love not this one per se but um but it's the one where it's the one where cards are flying everywhere can you see that those would all be fun to do now the task is figuring out how to do them working on some button tops we're gonna start with some bias tape. Making bias tape, that is.
Bye, have a great time.